The following steps outline how to install the Ranger battery charge port. Step 1. Start by removing the screws of the Ranger battery and pulling out the battery protective shell. Next, remove the four fixing screws. Step 2. Unplug the connection wire of the discharge end to replace it. Use a multimeter to test the connection before replacing. A sound from the multimeter indicates no issues, while no sound indicates a problem with the wire. In this case, a new 10A lamp head will need to be purchased. If replacing the wire, begin by replacing the plastic tube that wraps the battery wire at the charging end. Then, replace the plastic tube at the discharge end. Once both tubes are removed, replace the wire. Following these steps, the charging and discharge wires can be easily replaced separately. Step 3. Following installation, a multimeter can be utilized to verify the presence of power at the discharge port.
Within the battery discharge port, the left row signifies the negative pole, while the right row corresponds to the positive pole. A voltage reading of 57V is considered standard. Additionally, the voltage at the charging port can also be tested. Step 4. Upon completing the testing process, it is necessary to replace the plastic tube with a new one. Subsequently, safeguard the battery with cardboard, soften the plastic tube using a heat gun, secure it in an iron box, and protect the battery wires. To finish, insert all the batteries into the battery compartment, ensuring they are properly aligned, and use a screwdriver to securely fasten the screws diagonally.
Lastly, complete the installation by attaching the battery protective case. For more detailed information, please visit cyrusher.com.